guys. The mountain looks so beautiful. It's fucking freezing raining right now. There's snow all on the floor. It's like a slush right now because of the rain. Yesterday it was like ice hail. That's what hail is though. Oh, I feel slushy on the road. Um. Oh fuck, guys, it's so cold. I, ha I have to go to No Frills though to get some shit for the house. Um, I almost just fell there. It's not cold. The only thing that's cold or making it cold is the uh, is the rain. Like I really wish that the um, snow wasn't here, so I could uh, go out with my friends. None of them like the cold. I'd go out right now. Me and Cameron would. But I'm not with Cameron, so. You guys, holy fuck, my arms are dead. I was about to do my intro. It's actually the next day after yesterday. It was so, it's still so crappy out. You can hear all the slush. Ah, uh, this road is filled with just puddles, so shit. This road has been closed for months. And look at the tracks on the hill. People have drove down recently, even though the road's closed, which is pretty crazy. Kenilworth stairs, or sorry, no, this one's Wentworth. There's more at Kenilworth, which is way down like, Pretty far. Oh my god. Which is way down pretty far. Um, it smells like someone's smoking. What is going on here? It's like. It almost looks like a slimy sludge. No, it's liquid, but like. What's pushing all this water up? It's not a tunnel right there. I'm so confused. What the fuck? It's it's like chocolate milk when bubbles are coming up very slowly. What is going on here? It looks like when you pour food coloring in the milk and then put soap in it. Okay, but yeah, so Sunday, or sorry, Friday, all week, it's been snowing on and off. And then Friday, it started to snow a little bit harder. Sunday, or sorry, Saturday, it started to hail and it was just melting as soon as it hit to the ground. And then it got cold and froze over, all the roads were icy. And then Sunday, I was supposed to go to Little Monkeys again, but... Can you guess? That didn't happen. And then today, school's canceled, and I've been stuck inside all day. And now I'm about to show you why this is a death trap. So see, you got nice shoes. You see all this, but then you don't see that. Let's just pretend. Cause it looks like it'd be solid ice, but I don't want to look too much where the brown is because it kind of looks deep. Oh wait, no mind. It's still oh, <laughs> my hand looked huge there. It's still just so weird seeing this. Man's a savage. He's going up the closed room. I'm gonna. Never mind, it's not focusing. Actually, well, they fucking had light. That's pretty crazy. Oh shit. Yo, that focus is mad nice. I've been all the way down there. That way it ends off at like a school thing. Uh, that way I've been so damn far. Like, it's not even funny. I've been... It's a hard decision whether I want to go, but I know it's slippery. And there's... I've been down here many times. And I kind of want to save it for the summer for you guys. To see... Cause we go on bike rides down here all the time. We, I've biked all the way down from here to Mohawk Sports Complex. Well, far as I'm at, I've biked to Mount Albion or Albion Falls, whichever you want to say. I've biked all the way down there. Biked so much one day, it was so unreal. Me and Bryson, we were fucking, we just went off. We were at my house and we biked to the lake and then we had to go back to my house. And then we biked over to the mountain 
went all the way up to Mount Albion, then went back down to the lake. It was crazy. Like, I shit you not. It's hard to explain how much I biked that day, but trust me when I say a lot, I say a lot, because a lot of people would say biking two kilometers is a lot. That's... It's not very much, actually, if you really think about it. If you haven't already been able to tell, this is going to be a lot of cinematics in this video. So right there is the escarpment trail. That goes all the way down to Niagara Falls or I think farther than that. And right here is one of the Bruce trails. There's many Bruce trails. Like there's at least 100 little trails like this that lead off. This one's, I'm pretty sure, the main one. It's called Bruce Trail. It goes so damn far. It probably goes farther than where, where this one goes. Um, but there's many mini ones, many mini versions of this. So like, they're called Bruce Trail Side Something. It's called like Mini Bruce Trail Something. I don't, I don't remember what it's called, but there's many of those trails, and I wish I had my fucking tripod. There's so many things that I could record with the tripod. That's filming a bike cinematic. Not not even just a big tripod. All I need I have a small tripod from Dollarama that uh is looks really good. I haven't used it yet because there's a piece that I need to put my phone in so I can hook it up. It just screws on the top so your phone clips into it. It's pretty freaking cool, but I was filming a bike cinematic and I like skirted and my back wheel went and just barely hit the uh end of or the bottom of my tripod but because it was standing all the way up and you know science and shit where the uh <sighs> fucking but you guys this is usually like a staircase pathway thing very beautiful very beautiful it's cool how water just finds a path and just makes it their own Alright, so I made the executive decision. I'm gonna follow this small creek, which I kind of like better than the other one. I just wish it was rapid like that one. But I just love how it's more clear. The other one's filled with like clay, because this mountain, or this escarpment, is full of just clay and nonsense, really. So it's pretty sketchy because these shoes are pretty new. Bryson gave them to me. Thank you, Bryson. I've already said it to him a million times. So this creek splits off in two right here. It's a hard decision because it gets just very calm now. Because it splits off in two, so it's like not even close to what the pressure would normally be. Or I literally haven't turned my phone off since I got out of the uh, out of my house. Just had to go around that, and then you see where I stepped in some water. I'm not wet, luckily. Luckily, I dodged that pond too. You can see how far I've got up. Not too far, but... Oh shit. I hate when I get wiggly on the log. And he's got to jump. Sometimes it's very sketchy. Ask Alex. He's on top of a log once. Say about maybe 10 feet in. I don't think I can follow the creek up any longer. I did find a glass bottle, so... So... Um... I don't know where this is from. It says Quebec. And it's... How did that not break? This is sketchy. That rock is sketchy. It's moving. What the fuck? Um... Oh shit! Guys, my whole foot just went into that puddle. Ah, it's cold. Whew. Yo, my foot went so deep. What the? Yo! Get fuck that shit. Oh. Looks like someone set up camp where those ribbons are. Would go check it out to see if it's a camper. But for one, you're not allowed to camp here. 
in Hamilton there's lots of druggies and just people that'll do bad things to you so I don't feel like getting the needle or getting raped. So I'm gonna just quickly fuck off from that. It looks like glass from here but the bottom makes it look plastic. Yes, plastic. That sucks. Kinda wanted to break something. See, I would camp up in here, but like, it doesn't matter that it's tilted or anything. I can find flat spots, but like, there's just too many people that'll come up and rob you in the middle of the night or do bad things to you, kidnap you, drug you, everything. Looks like, see all these pillars right here? Down, down, here, here. Somewhat there, there's some more crackled underneath here. There's pillars here. It looks like the stairs either used to be a lot wider, or I don't know. Shit, bro. I don't know. The old guy, I don't know who he is. I'm gonna walk up these stairs. Well, I'm recording, which kind of sucks, because I got a sweet, or sweat coin. So, as I'm taking all these steps and recording, I don't get the steps because my phone's not shaking in my pocket. This is pretty cool, but I wish they colored it in. I I love the way this looks with all the different colors and stuff. But I kind of wish they made good graffiti like that and then colored it in. It just looks so much better. Uh, this is the other little part of the stairs you can see. Holy shit, that's a nice view. I've just been sitting here looking at this view. It's just so unreal. I love it. I don't know how kids, like, I understand how, but like, it's just so beautiful. I don't, it's hard to think why kids want to stay inside. I hate staying inside. I wish I could go out all the time. I wish I could go out at night, but it's not as fun by yourself. So you're just like, nah. That's, for me, uh, that's how I am. And then, at night time, obviously it's night time, so you gotta be in your house, but like, Hamilton, I could probably be out till 10 o'clock if I wasn't in Hamilton or like, in a bad city. Nah, maybe 9. But my curfew is 8.30, which kind of sucks, but you gotta live with it. Somebody else will get it. All right. There's a football. There's a couple glass bottles there. But I'm going to get out of here because I'm pretty shaky right now. And it's very nice to see all the water dripping, but these rocks are very loose. I don't want to... Oh, my bad. I didn't know. Oh, there we go. I didn't know that you were zoomed in. But these rocks are very loose and they could fall out at any time, especially like one fucking above me that's getting caked in water. The water wouldn't make it any better and make it easier for it to fall. I see a couple glass bottles right there. I don't know if you guys seen 
but I'm gonna get the fuck out of here. In the summer, I would try to climb this, but like, not when it's all wet and slippy. I wanna make my own some of these, but these ones are like professionally made. They got, they're not even colored by marker, like they're computer generated in their sticker. I wanna be able to color my own. I see another one of the same thing. This slush is fucking killing me. Same thing, I'm pretty sure it says prototype. And I thought the view couldn't get any better, honestly. Boy, it's so nice. All the little white dots on the house. It's just so nice. You can see the lake. Look, you can see where the lake turns over there. And this is supposed to be like the little split. Little mass, that little split looks so small. Just over there, I can see Cameron. No, I'm joking, that's just Burlington over there. There's a small park down there that I remember. Okay, so when me and Cameron ran up here, we ran into the parking lot of this building and waited for his mom. Me and Cameron would always go exploring from his house, and we'd always come along the mountain brow and just check it out. And I remember that exact freaking park right there. There were some kids playing at it, and me and Cameron were screaming at them and shit. It was awesome. We always used to have so much fun. I wish those days would come back. I was just right down there. It's a pretty far drop. But like, holy shit, look at this. You can see forever, bro. It's so nice from up here. If it was a more clear day, it would look so much nicer, but still, because it's raining, it's, it looks kind of misty. Because, you know, it's falling over there too. But there's more of it blocking my view. It's a hard decision whether I want to walk all the way down to the of stairs and then back to my house, because that's like, a six kilometer walk this way because it's up the mountain and the stairs go like this. So it's probably more than a six kilometer walk that way. And then a four kilometer walk back home. It's fucking... I remember that shit with the creek? Yeah. It's a hard decision, guys. It's a hard decision. Guys, I don't know what this is. I just found it. I'm gonna go check it out. That's actually really sketchy. You can see it. The guy behind me just got splashed with water by a car. I swear to God, bro, that would suck. I'm standing on top of it right now. I probably cannot get this up and it's probably gonna be freezing. So, yeah, fuck that. I couldn't get that alone. Maybe in a couple of years. Still a pretty good view. And I look down and it's just a hole out to the other side. Which gets me weirdly thinking, like, what the fuck? It looks like it should be a chimney with bricks missing right there. So I ain't gonna try and do too much shit. It's kind of crooked this way. The bricks are missing there. The bottom bricks, I don't know if they're just missing. I think they are because those are all brick, a bunch of bricks right there. So maybe someone tried to hit it out. Kind of looks like it collapsed in there. I don't know what it could be or what it is. I don't know why it's right here. I don't know. Jesus. Right there is like a huge ass drop, so I don't want to get too close. I could just imagine me, I'm not piercing, but you know that scroll shoot? I could just imagine me jumping up here, flying down all the way home. It'd be kind of cool. There's a booster seat there, like what four year olds use. There's a car seat there, and there was a stroller back there. There's. Still can't get over this view, but like. That guy's stuck in the snow. Oh, and he reversed. I hope he doesn't get stuck again. Oh, come on. Fuck, eh? Okay, so I walk from way... Let me see with my hands. Uh, I don't know where... Oh, that colorful. But, like, my school's over there somewhere. And I walk... Oh, see where that no fills is? I walk to that area. Oh. oh, he made it out, guys. I was just about, I was just about to hop. No, I don't smoke. I was just about to go push him through the snow, but. He got out in time. That guy just asked me for a smoke. What the fuck? <laughs>
Dude, my hands are frozen, guys. What is the smoke coming from? I don't know. Because there's this whole thing. Guys, so I started to get cold, so I decided, screw it. Why not just walk a little bit slower so I don't go as far in case I get really cold? And my phone died, and I, I threw a snowball off the thing, and it splattered out of the ground. I was about to record that. And then I didn't get to record that because my phone was dead. And as I was trying to turn it on, some guy pulled up beside me and said, Hey, you be careful jumping over that railing. It's slippery. You might fall off the edge, and that's a long way down. And it is a long way down. So I said, Okay, thank you. My hands were soaking and just all the way down. And since my phone was dead and I was recording half the time, I only probably got a quarter or maybe even less than a quarter of steps that I would normally get on sweet coin or sweat coin. Thank you for watching. Bye.